Have you ever wondered how you can make passive income while you sleep? Well, dividend investing might be your golden ticket to financial freedom. Now, I know it sounds like it could be too good to be true, but dividends is actually when companies pay back their investors in the form of dividends as a way to say, hey, thank you for investing into our company. Here's a little check that we're gonna deposit inside your account. Now, what they're hoping is that you take that check and reinvest it back into the company to help the company grow. But a lot of people end up growing such a large dividend portfolio that when these companies pay them dividends, they could take that check and live off of their dividends. They could pay bills, their car note, their electricity, and or go on vacation completely free by doing absolutely nothing at all. Now, if you buy one stock of a company, you are now part owner of that company. So now you are eligible to receive dividends from these companies. Not every company pay dividends and not every company is a good dividend paying company. Some of companies have low dividend yields, like half a percent. And some companies have high dividend yields of 15, 16, 17% dividend yield, but be worried that you just don't go out and buy any dividend company because they have a high dividend yield. Remember the higher dividend yield, the more money you'll make per month or quarter in the form of dividends from these companies. But if they paying out too much money in dividends back to you with a high dividend yield, how are they gonna grow this company if they're paying all of their investors, all of their profits, right? So you kinda wanna look for the medium. Uh, if you're a little bit confused about this, I'm gonna leave a link in the comment section to my um, Mastering Dividends ebook. Um, you do that ebook and you're going to know everything about dividend investing that, that you need to know. And you'll be a, a master um, in a couple of days just by looking at the ebook and you'll be well on your way to become financially free. That's going to be down in the pin comment section. Now, like the thumbnail says, over the last seven, eight years, I acquired a dividend portfolio, an investment portfolio of around $380,000, $85,000. In this video, I got paid out 21 times. I got paid out 21 dividends in January alone. In just one month, I'm going to show you guys how much I made in dividends by doing nothing. All I did was wake up 21 days out of the week. 21 times out of the week, I got paid dividends by doing absolutely nothing at all. I'm gonna show you guys uh, exactly how much I made. Could it be more? Absolutely, could it be less? Absolutely, but I'm gonna show you guys what to expect from a, a, a dividend portfolio like mine's, and then you guys can make your own decision. And then I'm gonna teach you about dividends throughout this video, um, what dividend kings are, what dividend aristocrats are, um, real estate REITs, um, monthly paying dividend stock, quarterly paying dividend stock. So make sure you, you pull out your pen and paper and go ahead and hit that thumbs up button, right? Hit that thumbs up button and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos and hit that thumbs up button. You actually make a cool little animation now and it helps out a content creator like me more than you can even imagine, guys. How do it help me out? I'm not sure, but it's completely free to hit that thumbs up button. So let's try to get like a thousand thumbs up thousand likes on this video in our share with a friend but before we dive into the video this video is brought to you by mumu sign up now by clicking the link down in the description deposit a hundred dollars and you can receive up to 15 free stocks with those free stocks you can keep them inside those portfolio and decide to use it or you can sell those free stocks it's up to you and right now they have an 8.1 cash week APY interest on the cash that's just sitting inside of your portfolio. Um, a lot of stocks don't even go up 8.1% in a single year. You guys could do that with cash just sitting inside your portfolio. I'm one of the greatest offers they had um, yet. Also, I'm gonna leave a link in the description to Weeble. Sign up with Weeble. You can deposit one penny if you want to, and you can receive up to 12 free stocks. With those free stocks, you could keep them inside the portfolio and decide to use it. Or you could sell those free stocks and withdraw all of your money. Guys, it's literally free money. Don't miss out on an amazing opportunity. But enough talking, let's go ahead and dive straight into this video. Welcome back, Germans here. Take a look at my account. I have $133,541 in this account. Let's take a look at my dividends, right? On January 2nd, I got paid out a dividend from Walmart, one of my favorite companies, ticker symbol WMT. I had 10 shares and they paid me out $6.08. Now, what I love about Walmart is that they are dividend kings. That means they increase their dividends every single year for the last 50 years and also is inside the S&P 500. That means they increased their dividend um, yield throughout a recession, a depression, a pandemic. Walmart was able to increase their dividend yields and not cut their dividends. And that's what makes them a dividend king by increasing it by 50 years and being inside the S&P 500. Um, this is one of the companies that I absolutely love and need to get more shares of. They pay out 57 cents per share and they pay me out $6.08. 
The next one, uh, I'm gonna gotta run through them pretty quick because I got paid 21 times. The next one was, was on January 5th. Now, um, this is PepsiCo, ticket symbol PEP. I got two shares. Um, they pay out $1.26 per share. So they pay me out $2.53. If you take a look at PepsiCo and scroll down, right, you guys can see that dividend yield right there. It says 2.89% dividend yield. And PepsiCo, I absolutely love. I'm up 18% on PepsiCo. I should've got a lot more of them. And PepsiCo is also a dividend king. They just, I think they increased it by 52 years now. They just became dividend kings. I was buying PepsiCo back when there was dividend aristocrats. Dividend aristocrats is any company that's inside the S&P 500 that's increased their dividends every single year for the last 25 years. You don't become a king until it's 50, before that it's 25. And let me tell you guys right now, there are not a lot of companies out there that are dividend aristocrats. So if you see a dividend aristocrat out there uh, that you like and that you love, that's doing pretty well, that might be a safe dividend play for you guys to invest into. Let's scroll through a couple other ones. We got Hero right here. Took some H-E-R-O. It's like a gaming um, ETF. They paid me out $1.21. That's going to bring my total to $9.82. I got QYLD paying me out 99 cents. That is a monthly paying stock. So Hero, PepsiCo, Walmart, those are all quarterly paying dividend stocks. That means they're going to pay me four times a year or every three months. QYLD is a monthly paying dividend stock. That means they're going to pay me every single month. So right there, I earned 99 cents from QYLD. The next one is Disney. Got 26 shares of Disney paying me out 30 cents per share. Total of $7.80. Um, the next one's AGNC, another monthly paying dividend stock. That is a real estate REIT, guys. Now, real estate REITs usually have a higher dividend yield because by law, they're required to pay back their investors 90% of their taxable income in the form of dividends back to their investors. So if we take a look at um, AGNC, you guys can see right there that they have a very high dividend yield of 15%. Now that is very high. Now AGNC could bounce back soon once the interest rate starts to pull back, but this is one of my REITs inside of my account, paying me a 15% dividend yield. Um, and I earn $14.28 from them. That's gonna bring my total to $32.89. The next one is LUV, um, Southwest Airline, paying me out $2.07. Ticker symbol O is known as the monthly paying dividend stock. This is a dividend aristocrat. This is a real estate REIT. So it's paying me out every single month. I own 10 shares, $2.73. And I also reinvested those back into the company. Remember, a dividend aristocrat increased their dividends every single year for 25 years. The next one is IIPR, paying me out $4.66. ONL paid me out 10 cents. And PSEC paid me out $1.43. That's going to be my total so far to $42.35. So that's going to be my total so far to $43.88. Um, SPHD paid me out $4.84. That is a high dividend low volatility ETF. That means it's not going to be a lot of volatility inside the stock market, um, but they are going to have a high dividend yield. If we take a look at that, they got a, a ETF. They Invest, they put a lot of that money into high paying ETFs and they have a dividend yield of 4.71%. Um, they pay me out $4.84. Um, PEY pay me out $9.38. And RITM pay me out $50. That's going to bring my total to um, $108.10. Let's take a look at our uh, ITM. I've been getting $50 from them for a while now. We see more $50, $50, $50, $50, $50, $50 month quarterly paying dividend stock. So I've been racking up. I've been racking up on dividends from RITM for a while now. So that is completely amazing. Um, I got 200 shares of them paying out 25 cents a share. Uh, QILD, once again, sometimes they pay out at the beginning of the month and at the end of the month. So sometimes you might get lucky and get double dividends from them in a single month. They pay me out a dollar and eight cents. Um, WDFC, that's WD40, pay me out 88 cents. SPY, that tracks the top 500 companies in America, uh, pay me out $7.60. And GPS, aka Gap, they paid me out $3.06. That's going to bring my total to $120.72 off of $130 ish thousand dollar portfolio. So let's take a look. As you guys can see, I got more coming up in February, but we'll get to February when we get there. Let's take a look at my other account. Okay, so on my Weibo account, I got around $250,000 in there. So we take a look at my history. 
Look at dividends coming up, right? Right here on January 8, 2024, QYLD paid me out $139.69, bringing my total to $260.41. Um, QQQ tracks the top technology companies, paid me out $3.08. And then once again, you guys can see QQQ pay me out at the end of January on the 30th. I got that double dividends from them, $150.72. And that's going to be my grand total to $414.21. Let's pull out my calculator. That is crazy. So I made $414 in a single month from dividends. Uh, that's around a $385 thousand dollar account now the dividend yield on my account is not that high because i just so happen to buy stocks that pay dividends but if i wanted to increase it i could increase it to around two to to around four to five percent dividend yield if i wanted to make it a true dividend portfolio but as you guys can see, I made $400 in a single month. If we multiply that by 12, I can make almost $5,000 a year right now, sitting back, doing nothing at all. I could bring in $5,000 a year. I could pay off a couple of bills. I'll take a very, very nice vacation with that $5,000 that I did not work hard for. I did not work for it at all. All I did was sit back, relax. I could reinvest these dividends and make more next year or I could take that $5,000 and do nothing at all. Now with $5,000 out of a, a $385,000 account, that is around a 1.1, 1.2% dividend yield on the account, which is kind of low, but if I wanted to increase it, I could buy more dividend paying stocks or higher paying dividend stocks to increase it to around like 5% because there's a peop there are people out there with a lot less money than me, a lot less money, a smaller account, let me put it like that, making way more in dividends with me. And there are people out there with uh, larger accounts than me making less dividends than I am. So it's all about how you structure your portfolio. And this month I got paid from 21 stocks, making $414 this month alone. So there we go, dreamers. Let me know down in the comment section how many companies paid you out this month. If one company paid you out or did 30 companies paid you out? Because when I first got started, I think my first year of dividend investing, I got paid out a total of $3.48 my first year. And then the next year it kept doubling. So it, it doesn't matter guys on how many companies are paying you out, how much you're making. It's, uh, it's about getting started and then eventually going your, growing your portfolio. So I went from making four dollars my first year to four hundred dollars in a month from my dividend portfolio just by consistently investing and growing my portfolio so down in the comment section let me know how many checks that you get this month in dividends do you even know what dividends are did you know what dividend king dividend aristocrat was real estate REIT was let me know all about that in the in the comment section and let me know if you want to say how much you made this month you can say how much you made this month because there are some smaller accounts out there that's risky that's making a whole but 15 percent dividend yield 15 percent dividend yield just straight up killing me um inside their account but you know they pay but probably got in at the perfect time on the dip and bought a great dividend stock on the dip and they're just riding that wave all the way up unfortunately i had missed that but if you guys are doing well let me know all about that in the comment section if you do want to learn more about dividends so i'm gonna leave a link in the comment section to my mastering dividends ebook um read that then you guys are going to be caught up to date and then you could come back to this video and understand everything that i'm talking about and then go ahead and hit that thumbs up button a second time let's see if it works a second time go ahead and hit that thumbs up button or share with a friend once again uh guys don't miss out on free stocks those links are going to be down in the description uh though to moo moo if you already got moo moo get weeboo if you already got weeboo get moo moo if you got robin hood get moo moo it's okay to have more than one brokerage especially if they having sweet deals like this that i have not seen in a, ever i haven't seen deals like this ever so go ahead and don't miss out on another amazing opportunity but uh other than that i'm zeke bring you the dream green show if you made it to if you made it this far hit subscribe go ahead hit the subscribe button why not right but uh other than that, I'm Zeke bringing you the Dream Green Show, and I'm out. Peace.